Father, I thank you today for the honour and privilege of praying for the nation of Australia. Father, I uphold to you the government leaders and our Prime Minister. Father, I pray that you would empower them to honour their position by acting with integrity, that you would give them strength and courage to make the decisions that are right, not simply the decisions that are easy. Father, I lift to you one of the um, issues that we have at the moment of asylum seekers and refugees. That, Lord, at the end of all debate and all political strategies, it will be your heart that governs these waters. Father, I thank you so much for the men and women who work the land of this nation. Father, those who contend with the extremes of drought or flood, I pray that you would see their harvests through to completion. I pray that you would give great wisdom in land management in ways that will sustain the country. Father, I thank you for the church universal within Australia. I thank you for each denomination and how they bring glory to your name through their own church culture. I pray for the leaders in each denominational head office, church, parish or parachurch organisation to know the influence and the power of your Holy Spirit. Father, I ask for your spiritual protection over them, their marriages and their family. I pray that you would reveal to them your good and perfect will. And Lord, that you would strengthen and uphold them in their roles. Father, I pray that you would stamp out strife and that unity within each group will prevail. That Christian leaders across all platforms and groups will find encouragement and support amongst one another. Father, with all love and respect, I lift before you the Aboriginal community across this land. Father, you see more deeply than anyone how ruined they feel as a people since white settlement and the interruption of their way of life. Lord, we know we can't do anything to undo the past, but Father, please reach into the lostness of this magnificent ancient culture provide a comfort and way forward that still preserves the uniqueness and beauty of who they are. Lord, give wisdom to tribal elders and Aboriginal Christian pastors as they walk forward upon this land. I pray that you will heal their bodies, restore their peace, captivate their hearts, that you would preserve their languages and dreamtime stories and culture, and that you will continue their story under a banner of your heart and vision. May your spirit sweep across this land to reveal a God who gave everything to bring every soul home, that the poor and downtrodden will find your arms, that the broken, addicted and depressed will find your healing, that the rich and successful Lord will find your love and your ways, and that, Father, your sons and daughters will continue to move in deep places of worshipping you and honouring you. Father, I thank you for this great country and ask that your spirit will move powerfully here. In Jesus' name, amen.